Hello, everybody. Thank you for taking the time to participate in that session about the importance of, uh, of interleaf development and manufacturing processes and inspection technologies in advanced packaging. If you talk about the importance of new technologies for integrated circuits, then today the manufacturing process are in the foreground. However, if you look at the implementation of these technologies, we quickly realize that further processes are needed in the environment of these technologies in order to successfully bring it um, forward and onto the road. One of these important procedures is inspection. What good is a technology if you not, cannot ensure its production under commercial boundary conditions? Poor yields and the lack of knowledge about sources of error can quickly drive a technology into an existential trouble. I will therefore start with an example from the past, where it is exactly where things went wrong. About 15 to 20 years ago, the automotive industry wanted to rely on a new technology, metal foams. The idea was to replace castings made out of solid material, such as aluminum, with a foam component. The advantages are obvious. A massive weight saving. We are talking about a factor of 10 to 20 in weight, in weight reduction, accompanied by corresponding material and cost saving with partially improved mechanical properties. It was obvious that hopes were pinned on these new components and reprocesses. The manufacturability of those foams was thus the focus of many research and development projects. Once the manufacturing process were has been stabilized to such an extent that they were commercially viable, the research began for suitable inspection technology. After all, they were intended for use in safety-relevant areas of vehicles and aircraft. Without the appropriate proof, um, as in especially the appropriate inspection technology, such components would never have been used in crash zones of vehicles, for example. As a result, projects were launched to develop inspection technologies that would be able to ensure the functional properties of a foam component on the one hand, and to do this in an economical way on the other. Unfortunately, these projects were started at a very late stage. Although the production technology was in a starting blocks, it could not be used due to the lack of the inspection and approval procedures. Unfortunately, the time window closed. What remained was a field and application of our metal foams in non-safety relevant areas of a vehicle. Today, for example, we find them only as noise absorbers or insulating materials in certain high-priced vehicles. What went wrong? From today's perspective, the effort and criticality of the inspection technology was significantly underestimated. At that time, no one would have thought that the entire application of forms would have a niche, niche existence due to the lack of inspection technology. Let us learn from that mistake. Let's look at the challenges in the semiconductor industry. The complexity of circuits is increasing extremely. Um, more and more, we are increasing the packaging density and also getting into the third dimension. Stacking of dyes has become a standard. But not only the number of layers is increasing, at the same time, the interconnection technology is shrinking. At the printed circuit board level, we are talking about interconnection elements in order of several hundred micrometers. When we go to stack memory elements, for example, we are now talking about just a few micrometers and sometimes even less. In addition, the requirements of these SOCs become more increasingly stringent due to the areas of application. If a circuit fails within a cell phone, for example, the damage is manageable. If it fails in an autonomous vehicle, human lives are at risk. This should be adequately explain the importance of inspection technology. But which inspection technology is, is the right one in the field of advanced packaging, especially against the background of the enormous increasing complexity and the extreme requirements? It is important to select the right technology, right inspection technology. If you look at the challenge, we see multiple overlapping structures, 
on the one hand and high sensitivity to ionizing radiation on the other. Despite the latter requirement in particular, the only technology that remain, remains is essentially X-ray technology, which is capable of reliably detecting defective features and providing conclusions about any root case causes. The X-ray technology required to solve all the tasks in the latest developments in advanced packaging does not yet exist in some areas. Considering the extremely short development cycles that are commonplace in advanced packaging, there is a risk that inspection technology will lag behind the requirements. What is needed, therefore, is an early start on projects to develop the necessary inspection technologies for advanced packaging production methods. And here I'm referring to the emerging 2 nanometer process, for which many of the resulting inspection tasks do not even have a solution yet. Due to the requirements for detectability and throughput, for example. Uh, I like to talk about interleaf development here. By this, I mean the simultaneous start of both development paths, inspection technology on the one hand, production technology on the other, and equally important, the trusting cooperation between two partners, co-creation. A pure customer supplier relationship is less promising than an open joint development. As an established manufacturer of expert inspection systems, I cordially invite you to this co-creation. Comet has made various experience in the target development of customer solutions. First and foremost, I would like to mention our sister division, Plasma Control Technologies. Get in touch with us to realize the next generation of advanced packaging. I always like to remind you that inspection technology is moving more and more into the direction of intelligent sensor not only ensuring the detection of anomalies and defects, but increasingly becoming an essential supplier of important information for production optimization and defect prevention. But I think you're certainly aware of that. We are ready. Thank you for your interest, and I look forward to your questions and feedback.